The new math building, first off, it's gorgeous. I love all the light that pours into the building. It just really illuminates the entire space and gives it this really cool modern vibe. The openness of the building so that when you step out of a classroom, you, you feel all of the other classrooms around you. It just feels like a much more collaborative space. You really feel like it's an environment that's conducive to math learning. And also, you have a building with a lot of creative designs. We quickly discovered in the first few days that we have people now hanging out in the hallway spaces doing and talking about math and statistics and computer programming in ways that they wouldn't have done in our old building. One of the things that we're most excited about in the new space is the flexibility of the classrooms and how that enables Harkness learning. And what this allows us to do is to have students work individually, in pairs, uh, in groups of three or four, and then as a whole class at any point in the class period. So it emphasizes the fact that learning math is supposed to be a collaborative experience and the board space and smart boards and the document camera provide the venue for students then to present to their peers, get critique from their peers and from us, and to deepen their understanding in that collaborative way. We have these really cool rolly desks that you can arrange into these different positions depending on which work you're doing. So when we do partner work, we can make little clusters. If we're taking a test, we can separate all of them. And that works really well because it just gives you a lot of flexibility in the classroom, which is really good for learning. This building is so well designed that the faculty can not only teach math but also refer to the mathematical designs in the building. So it's just math everywhere. We wanted early on to have a sort of sense of mathiness in the building and so the tessellations on parts of the floor that tile the plane, which means geometric figures that, that fill an entire plane with no empty space in between and they're wonderful pieces of geometry. We have beautiful images on glass window panes next to each of the classroom doors. We really tried to represent all the fields from math to statistics to computer science. We specifically paired the image from nature or art or architecture with the math that helps develop that. And so we're hoping that students will start to see the connection between their everyday world and the math that's going on behind it. What amazed me is how smoothly the math wing integrates into the science wing that was built about 17 years ago. It feels very natural and um, I think the two buildings are integrated really well. There's a great sense of continuity. So we're hoping that it will give us a chance to have further collaboration between math and science. I think the new math building is a huge step up from the old math building. One of the things we're most excited about has been having a building with a lot of light. And it really feels like a place where you can just think clearly because of how open it is. The building fits in as if it's been here for many years. Job well done. <laughs>